This is a Leica FSC bullet comparison forensic microscope. We've got, we've got it configured with a camera on the top. We can put different cameras on this. It has a C-mount for the standard C-mount style camera. It's got a light source. KL 2500 LCD, it's got the LCD readout on it. The single light source has a dual pipe, light, fiber optic going to both sides. This is all motorized and it's got some very convenient carrying handles on the top. This is a very large, large and heavy microscope. These carrying handles are very needed. It's also a good idea to put your hand down below too when you're carrying. I don't. I wouldn't trust all of the weight just on these handles. Here's where you would put the bullets, the bullet holders. You can rotate them. This particular unit is configured with three of the Plan Apo macro objective lenses, three on each side. This particular one is configured with one, two, and four power. All of these have iris diaphragms. By the way, if you look at it and you just can't get enough light to the specimen, then check your iris. You may have it closed way down. It's got some space for additional objectives if you need some. This is a current model line from Leica. So any parts that you need, any of the optional accessories that you'd like to buy can be purchased from Leica. As I said, this is all motorized. Let's try out the motorization. This raises it, raises the whole bridge, and then this lowers it. You've also got stage movements that are motorized. Left, right. Now if you hit this button, it synchronizes the stages. So I'm moving both stages the same way. And here's my Y movement. I'll turn off the synchronization, so then I'm just moving one at a time. This is my focusing. A little hard to see, but it is rising. Now it's lowering. These buttons are are for your, your image. You can hit L and it takes everything on the left side is 100% in your field of view. You can quickly hit one button and then the right side is 100% in your field of view. And you can hit the LR for left right and it'll give you a split image 50% 50%. Then you can hit the mix and it overlays the two. So you've got one on top of the other. These buttons adjust your divider line. You may want your divider line at 50-50 or you may want to move it. This does have some inserts. You may or may not want those. It's got the light holder. You adjust the light holder with these knobs and you can rotate it from up here. You can rotate your objective lenses. Let's rotate the microscope around. 
got some cords at the back here. This is a nice convenient tray to hold the light source, the fiber optic light source. This could be moved off to the side if you want. Take the tray off, then you don't have as much depth on your, on your table. If you're short of space this direction, I would do that. I'd take this off to the side. You could also put specimens if you wanted back here. This has got a lot of other connections at the back. It's got the stage right and the stage left. This controls the bridge. It's got some cold light sources, which we're not using any additional cold light sources other than this. It's got a serial port and some other fittings or connections. Overall this is a very clean, good quality microscope. We can compare this to an older version such as a DMC. This is, this is a lot better quality and the, the versions before. This is much better quality. The motorization is probably the nicest feature of this. You just have your hands here and control most of what you need to control. But the optical quality is superb on this unit. If you're interested in this Leica FSC microscope, please let us know. Thank you.